All right, what's up guys? It's JMD here. Now I'm bringing you guys another Dallas Mavericks episode against the Denver Nuggets. And this episode, we are facing the number one overall pick, Evan Cooper. And man, did he put, did he put on a show. This man, he's going to be a star one day in this league as Fidel Padillo, the third string center on our roster, gets a nice slam. He played very well this game. And I was very impressed as Taj Gibson gets that long mid-range to go. I usually don't shoot that far away, but I had to. He was wide open as Fidel scores once again. And this game comes right down to the wire. It goes to overtime. You guys will see. It, it gets pretty crazy towards the end as Justin Anderson hits a three-pointer. And we got Will the Thrill Barton over to Evan Cooper, and he makes the three fall. See, he's only got five points right there. He scores a lot more than that. But Taj Gibson gets the cutting slam right there as Evan Turner stepping back on Jeremy Lamb, and he's wide open for mid-range jumper to tie it up at 27. Now we got Fidel in the post, showing us that he has some offensive game using his seven foot one height. Uh, proves to be a very good advantage as the excellent move by Quincy Fall, kicking it back to Dirk for the buzzer beater. As we go into the third quarter, we see Fidel wide open, and he gets a nice one-handed slam. Now we got Will the Thrill over to Evan Cooper, wide open for three, and he makes us pay for that. But they leave Weston Matthews wide open for three for some reason, and we're right back in this game. Now we're up by one. We got Gibson on him, and then we leave Evan Cooper open for three again, and he splashes that one home. I'm saying, I'm just telling you guys, this man's going to be, he's going to be insane one day. It's Quincy Falk, that's like his signature shot, like that he dri drives down and just lays it in. As he actually hits a three-pointer, not the best jump shooter on the team, but he can certainly knock down, he can certainly knock down the jump shots. But now we got Evan Turner um, getting double teamed and there's Tony Snell wide open, a nice 15-footer right there, just easy money. Now we got Draymond Green getting the ball over to Tony Snell getting a tough layup to go. He had a he had a pretty good game. I think he had like eight points. And we see him. Will the thrill gives him space. And Tony Snell splashes that three home. So now Evan Cooper has it. And he gets the ball just swiped off the backboard by Fidel Padillo. Up to Evan Turner. The better Evan on the court right now with the slam. But Evan Cooper... Just proves that he is going to be a star with a nice, tough layup right there. So now we have Evan Turner. Sees Wesley Matthews for the nice 15-footer. We score. We always score, but then they always respond. As Dirk gets the signature fadeaway to fall, making it a three-point game with about 30 seconds left in the fourth. And the ball gets stolen from Evan Cooper. Draymond's running the break. Passes it off, Evan Cooper. We get the ball back, but it gets stolen once again. And we have to foul Emmanuel Moutier. One shot will probably seal the deal. He misses the first one. And he misses the second one. So we have the ball back. And you can see Wesley Matthews left wide open for three. And he made him, and he made him pay for leaving him wide open. It is a tie game. That was a terrible mistake on the Nuggets part. But they do have 12 seconds left. I'm trying to get the steal with Fidel. Nearly get the steal there. Moutier over to Cooper. You know Cooper's not passing the ball. He wants this He wants this winner right here. But he does. He sees Moutier wide open. We'll give him that shot. Not the best shooter. And Padillo gets the board and almost makes that one splash. Almost wins it for us right there. As we see him wide open off the off the tip I think he had 12 points this game I think he actually had a double double if not he was pretty close and good thing we got Taj Gibson who can hit those jump shots right there if, if we didn't it would, we would be in a rough, in rough shape now we get Draymond basically throwing the ball out of bounds so now there's 21 seconds left in the game we are up by two let's see what they're gonna do of course they give it they're gonna give it to Evan Cooper 
but he immediately gives it to Farid. Back to Moutier. Back over to Cooper with a spin move. Steps back, loses the ball, gets it again. Fades away and drains that shot. 78 all. 78 all. This is a close game right here, guys. So now we have 10 seconds to do something. Who's gonna be the hero? Who's gonna who's gonna win this game for us? We got Evan Turner. Evan Turner's looking for the ball. He got all right. He got the ball. Working on Moutier. And he loses the ball, but he gets it right back. Four seconds, three seconds, two seconds. He's got to put something up. Pulls up and knocks it down. Evan Turner is the hero. He knocks down the game-winning mid-range jump shot. As we take down Evan Cooper's Denver Nuggets. That was a great game. But Evan Turner had none of that. He pulls up and knocks that down. Evan Turner right there. The better, proved to be the better Evan on the court for this game. Final score is 80-78. to 78. A pretty high scoring game for my quarters. And here... You can see that Padillo did have a double-double, and Turner had 9 points, 12 assists. That's pretty sick. Alright, guys. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.